Hey everyone, Tarfu here with TGN for his very first video. In this episode, I'm going to be talking about how to make gold in World of Warcraft. It's pretty simple. First thing is, you're going to have to have two add-ons that I personally like. Auctioneer and Trade Skill Master. You can find the links down below. And if you need help setting them up, you can check out my YouTube page at youtube.com forward slash Tarfu Gaming. First things first is, I do a scan. And since this is my realm, I usually scan three times a day. But if you're going to a new realm and you want to try to play the economy on the new realm, you're going to want to uh, scan the auction house about three times a day for seven, seven days just to get the percentages and everything down. That's kind of how I do it. So there's my advice right there. All right, so let's jump right into it. All right, so right now I'm going to show you basically enchanting. The um the only stuff I usually sell with enchanting are scrolls, so it depends really on your realm. You just have to scope out your realm. That's the first thing. And for power torrents, I feel that it's a really good profit for if I'm just buying all my mats. But I usually don't buy my mats. I de jewel crafting items and whatnot. Um, so basically, all the mats for power torrent come out to about 434 gold on my server. And power torrent scroll sells for 1800 gold. So if I buy every single item for cheap on the auction house and resell it with the scroll, that would make a lot of profit. So you could do that with landslide, you could do that with the agility, and of course, for enchanting, do the lobby PvP enchants. Those sell very well and a huge profit for that. All right, now for my favorite two professions, alchemy and jewel crafting. The very first thing is for jewel crafting, I like to see what I could get elementary more for. Right now it's 52 gold, which I find very expensive. I buy for about 40, sometimes I could get for 25. It really depends on the day and who's really selling. Right now gems are really much down on my server because I haven't been playing the auction house on this server. It's pretty it's pretty hard because I got 13 characters I play uh, the economy on of different realms. So another thing is with jewel crafting for huge profit because you get ore for so cheap. You can make nightstone chokers, hessonite bands, you can make um, the pendants, the necklaces, basically anything. The jasper rings, all that stuff. You'll make the jewel crafting. You'll DE it all on your enchanter. And then you'll have all those mats for scrolls or even to sell it. For alchemy, I'll transmute all my the rare gems or uncommon gems into either rare gems or meta gems. Depending on how much everything's going for and what I feel comfortable selling it for. So... If the my hype gems I sell are purples, oranges, and reds, so just keep an eye out on your realm to see how much red gems go for and how your gems go on your economy. All right, for the most important part, basically my shopping list, what I think sells, Goldthorn is pretty much, in my opinion, the best item to sell because you need it to level up a few professions. Cobalt ore is another item. As you can see, I'm buying them all out, and I'll resell for 150 gold. Col Goldthorn basically would go for about 200 gold a stack that I sell on 18 different realms. So this is all U.S. realms. Thorium ore, mithril ore, thick leather, rugged leather, fell scales. Those in my personal opinion that I have tried and done sell for the most profit basically of reselling the item for cheap off the auction house and adding it higher to the auction house so just keep an eye out on your server for those items I mean there's always plenty of other items too, like the deviant fishes you could sell but those, in my opinion, are the high selling. Also, any other old gathering items that are not part of Cataclysm. Because a lot of Cataclysm items are botted nowadays. Alright, well that's it for this part. I will have two other parts to this exact same guide of how to make gold. And if you have any questions, leave a comment down below. 
basically if you want something added to this guide of how I make gold just playing the auction house I have other free gold guides on my YouTube page at Tarfu gaming also I did buy this mount while I was doing this video I spent 200,000 gold on it I love it and uh, well this is Tarfu from uh, TGN idol and thank you for watching and please leave a comment down below and check out my live stream at twitch.tv slash Tarfu